Hi, this is Jacqueline Leonard, and welcome to my video presentation. For my presentation, I decided to take a tri trip to the Metropolitan Museum of Art, also known as the Met. If I were to take a class on a trip there, I would explore the Native American culture through artwork. This would be for a social studies grade four class. The social studies standards would be standard one, the history of the United States and New York, and standard three, geography. The art standards would be standard three, responding to and analyzing works of art, and standard four, understanding the cultural dimensions and contributions of the arts. The artwork I decided to look at was the Rocky Mountains Landers Peak in 1863. You can't really see what the Native Americans are doing here, but this is such a beautiful picture. We'll find out. This is a little information about the artist. Albert Bernstein. He was born in Germany and when he was two years old he came here with his parents. Prior knowledge. Before taking the trip to the Met Museum, students would have learned about the Native Americans and their culture. Students will understand that culture is made up of many different factors and these factors vary from culture to culture. Although there is a great amount of diversity among, among different cultures, there is also a greater amount of unity. The Rocky Mountains. This paint, painting is a major work that resulted from Bjornstart's first trip to the West. In the spring of 1859, he accompanied an expedition with Con Connell Frederick W. Lander to the Nebraska Territory. Territory. By summer, the party had reached the Wind River Range of the Rocky Mountains and what is now Wyoming. Baron Stark called the central mountain in the picture Lander's Peak following the Colonel's death in the Civil War. It was completed in 1863, exhibited to great acclaim, and purchased in 1865 for then expensive sum of 25000 <laughs> Bjornstart later bought it back and gave it to his brother Edward. That was nice. Here's a little information about the author. Bjornstart is credited as the first painter to truly capture the boundless beauty of the untamed American wilderness, which would later become a unique part of America's history. He is best known for his enormous landscapes of the unsettled West. And after viewing these paintings, people be became more interested in preserving the national lands of the USA. Rocky Mountain Lander's Peak is a significant piece of art because it portrays what life was like for the Native American people and provides insight to their culture by showing a natural scene from their daily lives. I wish you guys could see this bigger, but if I zoom in, it, it won't look as good. This artwork describes the daily living of Native Americans. It shows where and how they lived somewhere in the West. Bjornstart illust illustrates the ways in which the Native Americans ate their food and vividly depicts the type of clothing the Native Americans wore. After the museum visit, students will gain new knowledge about the Native Americans to understand the roots this, of this country that they live in. Understand that there is unity and diversity in different cultures by exploring the Native American culture and compare their culture to the culture of the original Americans. My after museum activity would be have the children complete a homework assignment on comparing the ways in which people from different cultures think and deal with their physical environment and social conditions. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed my presentation. Bye.